Brian here from quantlabs.net. Today is October 28th, um, 17 or 5.30 p.m. It's your standard. I just want to talk about the um, updates I've put into the chat server. Uh, again, for anyone new, that's quantlabs.info. Just register. I have now taken out the ability just to be able to log in anonym anonymously as a guest. That's no more. And uh, if you were a guest, uh, you've been removed. So you have to re-register for a new account. Anyway, so once you get past that, what you will tend to do, you'll be introduced to a bunch of um, to a bunch of rooms based upon what you have available. So these are the various rooms that are available to you, depending upon your access. If you're uh, public and uh, are coming in. To, f to join on a freely basis. The quant analytics and elite order signals are two hidden rooms, so you will not get access to those. Um, everything else is free. So um, these two are available for my quant analytic members, and then this one will be available for my quant elite uh, um, members that uh, are trying to improve their orders and strategies by programming on MotorWave in Java. So here we have that everyone opens up with, it's just a general chat. I post a lot of my own private stuff here. This is the general chit chat area. Um, and then we move into uh, the nerds, which is more the technical stuff. Um, is you can also uh, flip between your um, rooms here based upon looking at control shift and then left arrow, right arrow. So here's the general, uh, here's the nerds room. This one right here, uh, so that's some programming talk there. Then we get into uh, my own news, um, which um, probably gonna start using more as this, this uh, chat sort of starts to grow. Um, the other one that is available is free. So again, if you wanna know about that, these are the free crypto trading signals. Okay, so these are available for people that um, want to get some sampling on some signals that we provide on entry. Uh, these are for Polkadot, Ethereum, and Cardano. Okay, so when they're active, you'll get the orders on the entry and exit along here. Also, we have a free newsroom right here. Uh, this is updated multiple times a day, uh, talking about Forex, gold, commodities, uh, crypto exchanges, some of the software uh, stuff that I get, I post all in here. So um, for each, each of these rooms, there's a limited amount of uh, data that is to be displayed. Usually uh, they may get, uh, depending upon the activity of the room, it may get, um, uh, deleted after a couple hours or even after a 24-hour basis so obviously you want to check in every so often to uh, check in on the news and stuff sometimes there'll be news on what's moving or what has moved or what's about to move in this I have nothing to do like I post the news um, but, I, but all the content I post here is just industry like you can see here we got stories from CNBC investing.com so on so forth uh, Yahoo Finance so the next room is the, um, this is the free signal room, as I said. The next room, these are the private rooms now. These are the hidden rooms. So if you are a member of, let's say, my quant analytics, here we watch all the top moving coins, um, both on Kraken and Coinbase. Kraken is the exchange I recommend to trade on wherever you live, um, it's just more honest, it has better customer support, da da da. And in here we also put in the chart setups if they're available. Also, um, the only reason I list here, Coinbase, do not recommend to use Coinbase for trading. End of story. Uh, you could lose your money there. I just keep uh, an account open with them with about $50 in there. I might start hodling out of them, I don't know, but it's just something I would not recommend to do at whatever crypto experience you have. Just people have had horror stories with Coinbase for hacking and so on and so forth. But anyways, we use the same thing where these are the movers, um, all and everything is in US dollars, so it's not in Tether, 
It's not in USDC, so it's not in crypto. It's in US dollar fiat currency. So when they do do that regulation on Tether or whatever crypto, um, you will not be affected because your your crypto will be done with real fiat currency, obviously US dollar. In here, we also have, these are the top movers. And then we also have the Coinbase uh, setups that you could feed into something like MotorWave. You can see here, and then you op apply the strategy. I've shown that before. Um, so it's a fairly, not a very complex process. Now, let me go into this. Now, again, these are hidden rooms. This is what makes th this room valuable and why people would want to join my uh, quant analytics service, not just to learn about crypto trading, but the course and the commentary I'll be having. But this is where it gets really interesting. This right here is the um, coins uh, that are top performing potential coins and movers. We have our entry p potential, so the higher it is, the better. Once it's negative, it means that there is definitely a, um, a sell signal. Uh, and you'll learn that from the uh, crypto course. Uh, and there are usually candle patterns that will show a negative. And if there's, you can tell there's a very bullish market right now. Um, because the entry right here is is uh, negative, uh, so this one Adam or Cosmos is not going to move. Along here on the second number is the order book ratio, the bid and ask ratio. On the order book, you can see it's very strong here on something like Chainlink, fairly strong on Bitcoin, so on and so forth. So that is updated every 15 minutes, okay? And that one, you if you're going to live trade it, you want to work off the one for Kraken because that's going to keep you in sync with your trades and the market data on Kraken. Coinbase is only listed for, um, just to give you a second view, uh, and you can see here that, um, yeah, things are moving on the charts. So that is how this works. And then there's one final room here which is the elite, which is really where the orders go, plus the um, this one's the, the really useful one. I'll probably throw this in my um, quant analytics. But this, this number right here for the risk on, for the date, uh, here it's 16.25, so an hour ago. This, this is updated, I think, every 15 minutes, uh, which is 4.11, which is very, very, very strong. If it's between zero and one, that means that the market's fairly it's not strong, but it's positive, and everything else out of that um, negative would be how, uh, everything's moving down. Uh, and but you could quantify that using this measurement. So that's the really good thing. Instead of listening to some so-called analyst saying, "Yeah, it's down," it doesn't really help you out when it, when you can measure the, the negativity of the market and the strength of the negativity. And as it approaches zero, you can see the strength come back, and then you know when you can get into the market. So. These are fairly, uh, very, very helpful. Uh, also, you got the orders in here as well. So you have the uh, Cosmos USD. This is my quantity, I've talked about that. Uh, and then the midpoint between the bid and ask price, the total amount, and then the bar size that we're watching on, it, which is 15 minutes. So those get um, recorded and um, that's, that's for just so when trades do happen. Right now we're testing out the new strategy, the merged one. So everything's going to be right now one minute, and, and that's why we have that data there. So um, this is going to be more for this room, the, the elite room, will be more, as I said, more for programmers and orders as we tweak out strategies that work. Um, and those are strategies developed in uh, the uh, MotorWave now in order to join that service. I haven't marketed yet, um, but it will be uh, marketed, and that's really marketed towards programmers and then want to use a rock solid platform like MotorWave to uh, to really optimize their trading potential with adding more to the, uh, adding more to their strategies when positions are put on so and so forth. Anyways, um, one last thing that I want to highlight here. Uh, this is on Linux Mint. So one of the other really good things with uh, this is you can turn the uh, chat server into its own little uh, app. So this is basically a uh, Google web app. Um, and let me just see if this will log me in. So I'm gonna enter my chat, so it's already been customized. So the, this is what you'll get uh, when you log in, right? You get the general chat and all the rooms that I've introduced, these two 
free uh, sorry the analytics uh, signals is the um, the uh, one for paying quant analytic members and everything else is free so general room general chat nerds for the tech stuff QLN which is on my office on my websites news uh, newsroom for industry news and then this last room oh and then the free crypto strain signals and again that is for um, uh, Cardano Ethereum and Polkadot that, those are just samples so people can get those and then here we have one last room called uh, portfolio analysis let me go to that here over here on the browser um, so here this is a, a room <clears throat> specifically designed for listing out the minimum quantity so if you are going to use something like MotoWave uh, just as an example here SNX um, it's come under uh, on MotoWave configure uh, configure instrument this is the order preset so if I look up SNX now this is connected into Kraken right here uh, edit and then you choose order preset with this right here is the default quantity at 1.27 so um, what I would suggest using this as a, as a resource tool is uh, as I said for SNX uh, where is it so SNX up here uh, it doesn't look like it's listed let me choose a better coin Let's do, I don't know, let's do Zcash. Now let's do Zcash. So Zcash here to trade that, um, this is how it works. So if I choose Zcash here, um, right this one, right here, edit, order, order preset, come on, order preset. And then here you'll see the 0.125 that's the basic default quantity so in here um, or sorry the minimum order so if you're gonna do a minimum order of 10 US dollars on Kraken this is the quantity you would need to make that happen usually um, you want to make it the equivalent of $15 if you're just testing out which is probably most what most people will do so for example here we have um, Zcash right here uh, if you were to trade on Coinbase at the full half percent each trip, which is really two trips for the entry and the exit, you're going to pay a 1%. So the entry would be half a percent in commission. The exit will be half a percent in commission. So it's a full percent for each trade you do. So here, the very first one to make just the basic order at the current price, you could do uh, 0 0.06 quantity. Uh, here in this default quantity okay then also if you want to get the cover the, the the amount covered with the one percent you will have to change for ZEC from 0 0.06 to cover the one percent if you choose to go on uh, Coinbase you need to have 1.28 to cover that commission now there's another uh, section that I post uh, this gets posted every six hours. There is another one for Kraken as well, but personally, I think it's better to use the one for Coinbase because they'll also cover your trades for Kraken. So, when it comes to Kraken, what this is really good for with this order minimum preset, this thing right here, is that uh, I've, I've talked about this before. Um, let me just clean this up. So what that really is for these these order presets is when you decide to go and apply a strategy um, a strategy on a chart. Let me just pull that up the charts here. So again, let me just randomly pull up um, a chart here that you you want based upon those chart setups. So let's say you have um, I don't know yeah let's say Zcash as an example. So we have Zcash here. So now we have the chart open. We can select our time period of one hour or 15 minutes, so on and so forth, right? So when you apply your strategy in case, let's say the new one that I'm working on, the uh, under uh, this one, the 
MACD reversing ATR trailing stop strategy in here, and this is, this is applied to all strategies under the strategy panel, or sorry, trading option panel, you'll see here the, the trading lot. So what you can do is you wanna trade this particular um, uh, coin, uh, Zcash, and this can be applied to all asset classes on, on MotoWave. So you have your lot size, so you have your order preset quantity at 0.12, as I said. If you set the trade lot at one, and you, you um, activate it, you create and you activate here, it, once an entry comes in or an exit, it will trade at that lot size of one times 0 0.12, which is the equivalent of, I don't know, 10, 15 dollars US at the current price today for Zcash. So again, if you go in and edit that uh, trading option, and you wanna trade 10 times, you just increase your trading lot at times 10 uh, for that, and then it will multiply whatever you set in the order preset uh, quantity and multiply it by 10 times five, whatever, and then you can apply the uh, update and then activate with the new trading lot size that you wanna trade at. So that's what this uh, portfolio thing is for uh, in, in the chat server. So it's a utility to help you determine what quantity you want to set for each and every coin. So I, like I said, it's probably better to stick with the quantities from Coinbase Pro. Anyway, so let's go recap everything here. Um, so again, we have all the rooms. So again, we, we can set up a Google Chrome web app uh, that's available, gonna run on your desktop. Now, just so you know, this will work on Linux, this will work on Android, and this will also work on Windows. So the one option for Android will work uh, as well. Just look for PWA in, um, P, uh, Portable Web Application, I believe it's called, and uh, you can run those. Now, you, you'll know I did not mention Apple, not for iPhone, not for Macs, because Apple does not support this technology. So we know where Apple is at these days. So anyways, we have all that. Let's recap everything here. So we got a bunch of rooms here. The, uh, the general chat right here, okay? And uh, we can cycle through each room. And here we have uh, the technical stuff, all the programming. Also, we have available um, the, the, uh, uh, the uh, general chat. We have the nerd room, then we have the free trading samples, as I said, all along here. Um, we can do the analytics for the hidden room for all the quant analytic folks. Then we have the portfolio as well, which I just talked about for the order quantity. You'll also notice here we have all the users listed and you can have private conversations with each and every person. So I could talk to myself here and then can talk to me the admin and go uh, if I'm online you go hello and it should pop up on my side here so yeah so I can yeah right here so that's available uh, as a private one-on-one -on -one conversation one thing I will say is that uh, the the um, chat server is private. When I say it's private, I mean it because we don't log things on this chat server, okay? It's anonymous on purpose, so it's, uh, it's, it's, it's private, it's anonymous, so you don't have to worry about any tracking on this at all. Um, just because there can be really sensitive stuff talked about on this thing, so we just delete it uh, when needed. Everything goes and um, yeah, and then it's just uh, all deleted. And usually all the conversations, uh, all the data you see here is not held for more than 24 hours. So it disappears. And that's it. So what I just said is that that's one of the reasons why you, you should check into the chat server every day to get the latest, unless you want to miss stuff, maybe on the news, as I said, for uh, multiple times a day if you want to keep up on the news. 
Um, I'm probably going to switch over the news to make it more, like, instead of me curating it, I'm going to get a, an automated process for that, and it's going to be based upon a uh, form of machine learning and all that to do that at some point. So right now, um, it's pretty exciting the way this thing's evolving. And uh, as be, I think one of the big features, selling features of it is, it's, as I said, it's privately anonymous. That's why I call it a private chat server. It's not like on Telegram or Signal even where that those those conversations can be intercepted because they're on those Telegram and Signal servers. So we'll leave it at that and uh, pretty, pretty exciting stuff. Other than that, we'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching.